What's going on YouTube? This is Travis from Chasing Anthems coming at you guys with another reaction video. Today we're checking out, uh, we're going back, we're going back to Frank Marino. Uh, this is a recent recommendation we got on one of the comments saying, go, if you want to hear Frank Marino at his best, great audio, great performance, the whole nine yards, check out live at the Agora Theater. I think I'm pronouncing that correctly. Um, the, the individual did not give me this specific song, but, uh, this one had the most views. So I'm assuming it's probably the most popular of this particular live show. So, Hey, if something's coming our way is not the one you let me know in the comments below, but, uh, I'm looking forward to going back to Frank. I remember the last time we checked out Frank Epic, amazing guitar player, awesome band, the whole nine yards, loved it. So I'm excited to come back around, which I love to do, especially when we don't get it right the first time. With that being said, thank you guys for shooting so much for tuning in. If you guys are new to the channel, you know what to do. Subscribe, hit the bell to be notified of future videos, like, comment, share, do all that kind of good stuff. You got links to our original music in the description box below. Please check it out. We got lots of shows coming on. Subscribe, follow us. Doesn't cost you a cent. Just do us a favor. Let's get on with this. All right. Before I gotta say, I love the drummer's aggression in this. That you know, the tom rolls that he's doing. That I, I would expect it in the build up into the chorus uh, and the high parts, but to carry on through the the verses uh, brings a lot of intensity. I do have to say too, I love this SG that he's playing here with the single coil pickups on there. Kind of reminds me if like a Strat and an SG had a baby, and this this was it. It sounds phenomenal. Um,
Yeah, Frank. There we go, baby. Live at the uh, Goro. Gora, Gora Theater. That sounds familiar, but I'm not 100 percent sure. One thing I gotta say, well, I could say a lot of different things about this solo, but you know what I like about it? I love how much in sync the band was with Frank as he was weaving in and out of different licks, different um, you know styles that he's throwing in there. He would hit certain root notes that the band would hit with them, which just really speaks to how tight they are as a group and how well rehearsed this is. Oftentimes you can see, especially in live performances, you know, guitarists will go off or, you know, they feel they're going in a direction and they just run with it. And maybe, you know, the studio version's three and a half minutes and the song ends up being 10 minutes live. Uh, you know, that's the beauty and fun of playing live shows is that artistic freedom. And maybe that was the case here. I'm, I, you know, I don't know. I haven't heard the studio version. And honestly, I don't know Frank that well, other, other than what we've been, you know, checking out on YouTube together. But uh, I love how the band was with them on those really key transitions it made for a, so much more in sync of a performance than just the guitarist up there on the pedestal and the band, uh, you know, just trying to support and hold it down. I do have to say, though, the bass player definitely looks out of place. He looks like, you know, they picked him up at Target or something on on the way to the show. No no offense, no no hate or anything there. The dude held it down. But uh, he just with the jeans and the polo shirt, it doesn't look like he fits into that, that rock mold. But hey, just just a funny observation. He definitely slayed it on the bass, held it down, and had some really nice transitions there um, in that pocket. Very in sync with the drummer, which is always key. Hey, just some observations. What do you guys think? Is this the one you guys want to be to check out from the Gora Theater? Uh, let me know in the comments below. But Frank, as always, knocks it out of the park. And so thank you for that recommendation. With that being said, thank you guys so much. If you're new, you know what to do. Subscribe, hit the bell to be notified of future videos. Like, comment, share, do that kind of good stuff. Go check out original stuff got a bunch of shows so you could definitely go and follow us on our website and other social media forums but with that being said i'll catch you guys in the next one peace yeah.